guys, my name's Alright Taz. This is Doug, the 2017 Classic 500 Royal Enfield, and today I'm going to install some knee pads roughly there to protect this beautiful chrome finish. I have a feeling this will scratch a bit with the seams on my jeans, so I'm going to put them there just to protect. I'm going to try and line up that line and that line just to appease my OCD I think it'll look pretty cool this is methylated spirits just to clean some of the crap off yeah, you can see it's already scratched a little bit so I got those off eBay Roughly where I'm gonna go there. Pretty good there. Up. Yeah, I'm pretty happy with that. Let's go around the other side. see I'll get my shorts out of the way you can see that my knees press straight in that's exactly the right position again nothing beats a road test so we'll take uh, Doug out on the road and give him a ride I'll go sit up g'day guys my name's all right Taz doodling along on Doug, my Royal Enfield Classic 500 in graphite. Road testing the knee pads I put on him to protect the beautiful chrome finish. I got these again from eBay. They're Chinese, they arrived in a couple of weeks, they weren't expensive at all. In my opinion they suit the bike, they look great. Go on within a couple of moments. And I can feel that I'm gripping them. Gripping the tank, it helps support your weight, your core, takes the weight off your wrists. So I can feel that they're in the exactly the right place. See them there. Fantastic. Again, not much else to say. Pretty easy modification, line them up, stick them on, go out and ride. Guys, my name's Alright Taz, 
these are the Royal Enfield Adventures. I'll see you next time. Till then, I'm out.